I'm Joe from No Studio and I'm looking at the Abominable Electronics Tote Machine. Um, now, the artwork on this is amazing uh, and with a name like the Tote Machine, you kind of just know what you're in for. It's a dark, dirty fuzz that is tailored towards... Uh, uh, I'm using my ESP LTD uh, sort of with a, an EMG, the Stealth guitar, uh, and the Ampeg V4, which is running into um, our Mountain 2x12, mic'd up with an AEA N22 and a Heil PR30, going through my Tone Lux preamps nice and clean, nice and simple. Um, so, with everything at 12 o'clock on the pedal, we'll see how it sounds. Ooh. Doing that like low, sort of just nice thick fuzz. Um, generally, that's not going to like cut through in a mix. It's only going to be really when you've got like one guitar on its own. Um, but this pedal has a bunch of extra features. There's a second like clipping mode and a second gain stage for each of those sort of gain. Uh, each of those like clipping modes, whatever it is. Um, and by switching that on, it runs, you, it runs your signal through these like red LEDs, which are part of the burning church, obviously. And um, that just gives you like a, a little bit of extra like gain on everything, like it all saturates a bit more. Let's see if we roll the tone up again, see what that sounds like. <laughs> like a lot in sessions because it sounds amazing um, but generally I tend to partner it with like a, another like preamp pedal or something just to sort of give it that top end boost and like a bit more presence um, just because I find like there's so much like low end in this and it almost like makes everything bottom out and the speakers on the cab end up just like farting at you um, and if you want to play like a proper doom band and play one note every 20 minutes then this is uh this will do it sustain for days <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.